you know, walking away with 35 feet of waste is a, is a beautiful thing, but you just never know, you know, what you're going to run into. So being able to carry an extra coil with you and just knock one more panel out um, as you go really, really helps change the game. My name is Joe Keen. I'm with Integrity Metals. Like I said, my previous employer, we ran, um, we ran fleets of those machines across the nation. We ran every single profile you could run on them. And we had a crated division and we had an on-site division. Um, we ran that machine uh, in the shop to, you know, when we were crating and we took it in the field and when we weren't. Um, you know, have you ever had a job with 76 foot panels on it? You know, might be my first question I asked him. Do you ever want one? You know, because you're not going to ship that panel uh, without cutting it in half. Do you like seaming panels? I don't, you know, so uh, maybe that'd be a good question. You know, if maybe they've used another roll former. Um, I've used other roll formers where the panels come out neck high, uh, where it has to stop to shear the panel, you know, with 30 foot of panel sticking out of the rear end of it. Uh, you know, there's, there's pluses and minuses to all these things, but um, I'd say the ability to Im import panelists via USB where you're not having to re-enter, uh, you take the human error out on the backside of that thing. Uh, you don't have to worry about your guys going out and re-entering data into a, uh, into a machine that you've already had to re-enter that somebody else sent to you via email or on a napkin or however you know it was transpired to you in the first place. So, um, I mean, I could think of a pretty long list of questions to ask them why, why they're not interested in a new tech machine. Um, I guess that's a couple of them.